All right, so what we're going to do here is we're going to impersonate. Who are you going to be? I'm going to be Kyle. Who are you going to be? You going to be me? Brad. Because you already got the bald head. All right. All right, guys, so we are here at the Proprietor's Cup. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> hold on. All right, guys, so we're here at the Proprietor's Cup. I don't watch enough of your videos to know how you act. <laughs> <laughs> we. <laughs> That was me impersonating you. Did you like my impersonation? Oh, I just heard a lot of. I just got like on. I got like I, really energetic. What's going on? And then I and then I play with my hair. I did it like six times. That's about right. That's my that's my nervous <laughs> hand tickle. I'm not really sure what I'm doing. I'm like, oh, hey. what's going on, everyone? <laughs> Why are you stretching, old man? You should have seen him. Dude, you didn't have hips. He surgery, like did you? he was doing some kind of weird oh, maneuver. Oh, down. A little slow rolling yoga Ooh. in the morning. Shout out hey, to uh, yeah, shout out to Sarah Beth yoga page. <laughs> Dang it, Nick. <laughs> Dude, I was getting ready to turn on the camera and I saw Nick back there. How's life, buddy? It's good. How's you, yours, Brad? You look good. We actually get a ton of comments in the blog just asking, like, what, we, what's Nick up to today? What's, I know. You're How's liar. things going on? What do you have for breakfast this Tuesday morning? I mean, it's, it's weird. It's literally like, hey, can you do a bar review on this? Can you make this instructional video? How's Nick doing today? <laughs> <laughs> well, we know he's not getting a haircut. We know that. Dude, you should shave it all off. I'll shave my head if you shave your, shave Wait, your no, head. No, 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 no. That's not fair. That is fair. Hey, it's the cuss word guy. Hey. Yeah, you need to give a formal Be apology. Be nice. To yeah, the you know what I say blog. about apologies? <laughs> <laughs> we don't have enough time now, but in the intermission, I'm gonna explain to you guys how I've lost $900 so far. So stay tuned. All right, Brad needs a little cheeky double here to snap me off second game. <laughs> Looked like you wanted that one. Oh, Not for the tournament, game. but more for pride. This one is 10 back. Okay. I gotta wipe my ball off. That means you're gonna four pin. That's four pin all day if you wipe that ball off. Now I'm gonna move like two left and two pin. Either one works for me. Nothing happened. No story no. here. No. <laughs> I don't know what it yes. has. What'd you have? 94. 94 over? Yeah. 94 over? God, I lapped you. It wasn't even close. 97? 98? No, 106. No, say. Kyle backed up hard the last <laughs> You have no idea. Oh well, just lost more money. Not a big deal. It's just money. You can get it's it just back. Just money. Who cares? Right. Who cares about money? We got a YouTube channel. Who cares? They got more money. You guys got more money Dole's than God? Dole's got more money than God. Oh, what's the tally? Okay. Here it is. Did you really just touch the... He, he did it. Yeah, he I was gonna, it. I was gonna act like I was holding it. All right, guys, and then you just hold it. All right. So this is the update of how much money Kyle has won and lost. Emphasis on the loss this weekend. Okay. Doubles entry was 125. We did not cash. Thank you, Brad. You're welcome. Doubles brackets. We were in 390 dollars a piece. Got back 20. So for a total loss of 495. We're now 495 from the doubles. Then I bowled two bolongos. 80 dollars a set. Bowled two of those. Did not cash, lost 160, so add that to the total. Team event went surprisingly okay, only lost $84, not too mad. And then today is a $700 entry fee, we don't know, need a really big block this next block. Brackets, I definitely went goose egg, so I lost 300 the second block, and we'll see how much I got back, but that number is to be determined. So right now, I'm down about $700. About $700. Just, just today? Just so far this trip. The number is undefined right now, but that's a quick update. We'll update you after the six games. How much do you hate Brad? It's over 11 on a scale of 1 to 10 for sure. <laughs> yeah, I'm about 1100. I hate him about... It's embarrassing Don't, actually. I mean, just look at that stupid... I just want to take a 500 pad of Avalon and rub it on his forehead. Yeah. Times the Asian guy the Oh my gosh. <laughs> Why does he have a YouTube channel? We all know the only reason he has a YouTube channel is because Kyle is personable. And Brad is just stupid. If I pick on someone, that means I like him. <laughs> all right, I'm updating after this block again how much money I've lost today. So, second set of brackets. I don't know what the total is now, but it's going to go on the screen right now. Cumulative total. Bang. I think we'll be able to make that work. Okay. <laughs> second set of brackets. Put in 355. Back 310. Loss, 45. Total bracket loss for the day, $165. I thought you bowled good this last three games. I did. I got back 
I turned 140 in the 310, but the set before, I turned 240 oh, in the yeah. zero. I don't know what my cumulative loss is because I am close to making the cut <laughs> right now. There is a chance he misses the cut by like just a few there pins. Is. If that happens, like one of the worst <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be awful. Be, if I lose, happen. it's gonna be like a two thousand dollar loss on the weekend. But that's the grind that we kind of live. Yeah, it's the life we choose. On these events, it's more about the action. This event specifically, a lot of our events aren't yeah. like that. This one's just like a, a cash spray. But the weird part shoot, is, shoot, normally shoot. there's people throwing my yeah. money like crazy, yeah. and this year there's no action. I don't know what was going on. The tournament's kind of going through some weird things. But normally the Proc Cup, there's a lot of action. Either way, we'll see. So. I'm sweating it. Brad, he's got to hope they put out <laughs> US Open or Sydney or something. And he might have a chance. There it is. Time to sweat. <laughs> All right. Morning, everyone. I can't so believe we, you're breaking even. Breaking this even. doesn't even make sense. So, got lucky, made the cut, made the cut by five pins. That seems that, you know what? I seem to sneak into those cuts every now and then. Well, I saw last <laughs> night you guys, you were in by like five spots. So I thought you made it by a mile. And then this I know. morning I saw those five sticks. And there's a one ball roll off right behind me, which is a, it's a, it's a little bit skeptical, a little bit controversial, but hey, Why? I don't know. It's one ball roll off for 1,400 bucks. <laughs> they don't even get a game. So for how much money I've won and lost, total for the tournament right now, I'm in for $1,504. That was my loss. I'm down $1,504, but we're guaranteed a cash today. I think min cash is $1,400. So now I'm only losing $104 total <coughs> if I get the last cash spot. Hopefully we can make a little run today. <coughs> After this week is gone, <sighs> only down 100 bucks. Are you, got, you all right? Yeah, I'm <laughs> only down 100 bucks, I'll take it. But hopefully we can make a little bit more. Mitch, what's the uh, ball of choice for this roll off? Oh, you remember that one video? Straight, you, took you going straight? You remember that one video you took of me throwing a straight ball against AJ and just ten back? That's yeah. That's how you're gonna throw it. Not even messing around with. Right. Why mess with you know missing rod? Maybe two penny. Just rely on accuracy. It's a bold strategy. The showdown. Mitch Hupe versus Sean No. One ball roll off. What's the game plan here? Mitch told me he's throwing it straight hard at the head pin. At this point, I think it's a, a good bet. <laughs> one it's shot. Not, not, not nine to ten, not a whole game. It's 1400 one bucks, shot. one shot. All right, so there was a tie for the last cash spot. So Mitch Hupe and Sean Nauman have to do a one ball roll off for the last. Sean Nauman's in. Matson, how's it how's it going? Pretty good. Actually, is it actually going actually good? Not. Let's let's check the score out real quick. Uh. Dollar ninety-five up there in the top right. I suck at multi-pin spares. Definitely. You chopped two of them. You chopped yeah. a bucket yeah. and then you chopped something else. Uh, six nine. Why? Because I suck at multi-pin spares. <laughs> Okay, so we have like the craziest scenario going on right now. This guy, actually, this guy needs a strike right here. That keeps him in. Now Kyle needs a strike right here to stay ahead of Chapman and Tommy Jones. I believe if he gets this one, he's in. I think you're in. I got myself a chance. It's pretty good. I told myself to throw 12 good shots. Got really lucky for the first six frames. <laughs> All right. All right, starting the drive home. Eventful day. Um, I'll give you guys a quick update on my plus or minus winnings for the week since we got some good news. Well, good news for me. Uh, we were chopping. What? 
Yeah. No. We told them water earlier than we no. were chopping. Did not say any. Did not say anything about that. That's what anyway, I here we go. So, little recap of what happened. Okay, so in the doubles, I lost four hundred and ninety-five dollars. Bowl two bowling goes for one hundred and sixty. Didn't cash, so I lost one sixty there. Team event loss of eighty four dollars, and then the main event was a seven hundred dollar entry fee, which is crazy. That's so expensive. Brackets for the main event, I lost one hundred and sixty five dollars. So that is a total amount of expenses of sixteen hundred and four dollars. But there's a but. I cashed four two thousand three hundred and fifty dollars what what <laughs> cashers round shot 279 the last game to jump in the top 10 by three pins absolutely nuts only to dunk it off in the finals Can i shot explain that scenario a little bit rather not All right. so you were 72 pins out of the number with okay. one game to go and three of the four people that were ahead of you shot 250 yes and you jumped all of them and I jumped them. To make it by three They seconds. were probably. And Tommy Jones had the front eight, and he opened in the 10th to shoot 255. And I guess Chapman struck out, and then Ostrander uh, opened in the eighth. And then you struck out, shoot 79 to make it by three pins. It was, a, it was an insane, like, I was pretty bored most of the time, but that last, like, six frames was like, oh, my God. I had Tang's mom there with <laughs> me and Vi's mom, and we're like, okay, who's got here? Oh, Tommy just opened. And it was, uh, it was pretty insane. So, ended up cashing in, making the top ten, getting a decent cash. So, my running total for the week was I won $746. Four days of bowling, cha -ching. putting up all this money, and I came up $746 ahead. For all you guys that worked your nine to five this week, you probably made a lot more than that. It was probably a lot less stressful. Yeah. The reason we wanted to give you guys some of those numbers, uh, the plus or minus this week, to show you that this is a grind, is a serious grind out here. This is one of those tournaments where you gotta put up a lot of money to try to make money. So the hard part about bowling for a living is, there's a chance that you can lose money at your job that week, which someone else in the car did. <laughs> Ninth place for me, didn't make the cut, Brad. <laughs> overall, <laughs> overall, uh, good weekend. We stayed at, our, we always stay at our buddy's house and it's an amazing time. Shout out to Drew Sachs, fellow Columbia 300 staffer, just graduated, coming to Lindawood, representing the uh, Lindawood Lions. Yeah. Anyway, all right guys, we're done. Prop cup in the books. Hope you enjoyed that. See you next time.